out from the 
pass out because I'm overwhelmed and not die from the heat. And my room is like the only place in my house that has an air conditioner in it. So I ran, I just kind of sat in my room after I cleaned my finger. It was just very eventful and like my brother was not awake and my brother's a very heavy sleeper. Like, very heavy. Like he has to be physically shaken multiple times before like he even like reaches a state of consciousness. It was always fun because I was the one that I would have to like wake him up for school. Um, that was me on my chair. Six years. Don't remember any of it. No, I'm just kidding. Um. 
stuff like back there like I got it for Christmas because I'm very German and I really want to go to Switzerland I wanted to go to Germany at first but then I wanted to go to Switzerland just because I, I, I think it would be so much more fun and I feel like it's just so beautiful there but I really want to learn German A for more cultural into like input and do just for fun because I love learning languages um but I know um, my grandfather's last name is Christoph. That was actually going to that was actually going to be my brother's first name, Christoph. My last name, but like with my last name, it's not good. Christoph Groff. No, we, we did not. Said his name is Ethan. <laughs> it was going to be Noah. My name is going to be Emma, but there's reasons behind that. I don't feel like explaining why my name is not Emma, because it's disgusting, thanks to my father. Because my great-grandmother was Emma, Emma, yeah, Rose, Emma, Emma Rose, I don't remember. Um, yeah, and then, but my mom was like, I want her name to be spelled different. So that's why it's E-M-I-L-E-E. -E. And then my middle name is Rebecca, but it's spelled R-E-B-E-K-A-H. But I'm also supposedly Native American, which makes sense. Because I have, like, more yellow toned to skin. Um, and I tan really easily. Um, supposedly, one of my great-great-great-great-great-great-great-grandfathers on my dad's side was, like, a chief of like the Mohawk, I want to say. Which I think it's cool. And I'm also Italian on my dad's side. And a little German. I'm just very German. Um, but I like don't know like any German. I've always wanted to like grow up with a second language. I always thought that would be so fun. Maybe I'll like move to like Spain or something and then. I'll get married to like some Spanish guy and my kids will grow up with English and Spanish but I feel like you learn English in like every other European country that's not English dominated speaking anyway I could be wrong but like at a young age which I understand English is hard it's like the eighth most difficult language to learn because you got like there 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 Um, yeah, another thing I keep forgetting to do is I'm trying to learn tarot. Um, I'm very into the spiritual world. Um, I don't, I'm agnostic, so I don't really believe in, like, God or anything. Um, I try to, like, keep, I don't care if you do, like, it's your own thing, I know. It's your beliefs. I'm not here to judge, I'm just here to help you sleep. <laughs> um. It's very fun, and I have, I think I'm partially an, em an empath. Um, I'm not, like, to the full extent of, like, I can just read your feelings and stuff. But I know, like, for tarot, like, if you're, like, a very, like, empath, if you know what that means, um, some people can, like, have tarot cards and give you a tarot reading and have never even looked at tarot cards before or their definitions and tell you what each card means and I'm like and I've done readings on um my mom, my brother, my aunt, my uncle and my one friend and um my friend and my aunt are very more in touch with like like they're more open to like spirituality and stuff and I gave some of probably the best readings I've ever given compared to like my mom like my mom I gave pretty good readings but compared to like my brother and my uncle because I feel like they weren't as open to it and I could like feel that I feel like I sound crazy to people that like don't believe in the spiritual world I also want to try to get back into more zodiac stuff I'm a Pisces but I was born on the day of a Pisces um so I also can be Aquarius um, but I looked up, like, for that, like, website where, like, you put in, like, your specific, like, time you were born, where you were born and all that, and it was so accurate. 
it. It was scary. Like, I know my sun sign, my star sign is Pisces, and then I want to say my rising moon is a Libra, or, and then my ascending, or my rising is a Libra. I think, I don't remember. I had to, like, look it up. 